Blessed is our God, always, now, and forever, and under the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to you, our God, glory to you, O heavenly King, the Comforter, the Spirit of Truth, present in all places and filling all things, the treasury of blessings and the giver of life. Come and dwell in us, cleanse us of all stain, and save our souls, O good one. Amen. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy. 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 Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship God, our King, and bow down before him. Come, let us worship Christ God, our King, and bow down before him. Mercy on me. In the greatness of your love, in the abundance of your tender mercies, wipe out my offense. Wash me thoroughly from malice and cleanse me from sin, for I am well aware of my malice, and my sins are before me always. It is you alone I have offended. I have done what is evil in your sight. Therefore you are justified in your actions and triumphant in your judgment. Behold, I was conceived in iniquities and in sins my mother conceived me. But you are the lover of truth. You have shown me the depths and secrets of your wisdom. Wash me with hyssop and I shall be pure. Cleanse me and I shall be whiter than snow. Let me hear the sounds of joy and feasting. These bones that were afflicted shall rejoice. Turn your face away from my offenses and wipe away all my sins. A spotless heart create in me, O God. Renew a steadfast spirit within me. Cast me not afar from your face. Take not your blessed spirit out of me. Restore to me the joy of your salvation and let your guiding spirit dwell in me. I will teach your ways to sinners and the wicked shall return to you. Deliver me from blood guilt, O God, the God of my salvation, and my tongue will joyfully sing of your righteousness. O Lord, you shall open my lips, and my mouth will declare your praise. Had you desired sacrifice, I would have offered it, but you will not be satisfied with whole burnt offerings. Sacrifice to God is a contrite spirit, a crushed and humbled heart God will not spurn. In your kindness, O Lord, be bountiful to Zion. May the walls of Jerusalem be built. Then you shall delight in just oblation, and sacrifice and whole burnt offerings. Then shall they offer calves upon your altar. O God.
Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace and goodwill to men. We praise you, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you, we give thanks to you for the splendor of your glory. O Lord, King, Heavenly God, Father Almighty, O Lord, Only Begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and you, all Holy Spirit, O Lord God, Lamb of God, the Son of the Father, who take away... creator of heaven and earth, and of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten, not created, of one essence with the Father, through whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary and became man. He was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate, and suffered and was buried, and he rose on the third day according to the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come again with glory to judge the living and dead. His kingdom shall have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the creator of life, who proceeds from the Father, who together with the Father and the Son is worshiped and glorified, who spoke through the prophets, in one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the age to come. Amen. It is fitting and right to call you blessed. You are truly the mother of God. You do we exalt. My mouth shall I open up, and by the Spirit it shall be filled, and I shall pour out a word unto the mother and queen, and I shall be seen in cheerful celebration, and joyfully I shall sing, lauding her miracles. Most holy Theotokos Evas, O pure one beholding you, the great archangel exclaimed to you, the animate book of Christ which by the Spirit was sealed, Maiden full of grace, rejoice, O joy's container, through whom shall be nullified the primal mother. Of the ruler of all rejoice. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Rejoice you, the only one who budded forth the unfailing rose. Rejoice who have given birth unto the sweet apple tree. Aromatic balm of all creation's monarch. Rejoice, O oh, unwedded bride, the world's deliverance both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O treasure of chastity, rejoice through you we have risen up. From out of our fall, rejoice, sweet-smelling lily that sends 
forth its fragrant scent, O lady to the faithful, aromatic incense and costly anointing oil. Establish a holy Theotoko, so living and ever welling found, your choristers assemble here in spiritual. Dark rejoice, who has diminished utterly the darkened demons of Lucifer, both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Rejoice only, veritable East Gate, that only the Logos has gone through. Rejoice, for in your giving birth you shattered Hades' bars and gates. A laudable rejoice, divine, entrance of those who are being saved. He who sits in holy glory on the throne of divinity, on a swift and light cloud, Jesus has arrived, the surpassing God, and by the might of his undefiled hand has saved those who cry aloud, Glory, O Christ, to your power be. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Unto you in songful voices do we loyally say rejoice. Rich and curdled mountain, in the Holy Spirit all audible. Rejoice, O seven branch lampstand and the golden jar. With the manna bread sweet, to the palate of pious folk. Most holy Theotoko, save us. O oh, rejoice, untainted lady, mercy seat for the world rejoice. Ladder elevating, everyone from earth by an act of grace. Rejoice, O oh, heavenly bridge that is conveying from death unto life in truth. All those who chant hymns of praise to you, most holy Theotoko, save us. More exalted than the heavens, O Immaculate, made rejoice as the one who carried earth's foundation painlessly in your womb. Rejoice, O mollusk, who died in your own virgin blood. The divine purple robe worn by the King of angelic hosts. Glory to the Father and to the Son. of ages, amen. We extol you who have woven the unwoven by human hands, crown of hope and glory for the world, O Virgin, and say rejoice to you the fortification and the citadel and protective wall 
and sacred refuge for everyone. Amazed was the universe by your divine magnificence, for while never consummating wedlock, you held a virgin, the God of all, in your womb, and gave birth unto a timeless Son, who rewards salvation to all who chant hymns of praise to you. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Rejoice, for you carried in your womb the way that leads to life. Bride of God, rejoice, all blameless maiden, who saved the world from the flood of sin. Rejoice, our inspiring message and report, habitation of the one who is Lord of creation all. Most holy Theotoko, save us. The might and the fortress of the human race, O oh spotless one. Oh, rejoice, the holy place of glory. Slayer of Hades, the bridal chamber of light. Delight of the angels, oh, rejoice. Helper of the ones who pray to you faithfully, oh, rejoice. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Rejoice, fiery chariot of God, the Word and risen Son, Lady, living paradise, O garden, which in its center contains the tree of life, the Lord whose deliciousness gives life unto those who eat with faith, who were subject unto decay. Glory to the Father and to the Son. Rejoice unto you, the city of the great King, about which glorious and remarkable things perspicuously have been declared. O oh, unquarried mountain and depth unfathomable, rejoice both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Rejoice, O immaculate, the spacious dwelling of the word, seashell that produces the divine pearl. Rejoice, O lady, exceeding wonderful, reconciliation with the Lord, for all who beatify you, the mother of God, each day. O oh, godly people, as we observe this solemn and divine feast in honor of the Mother of our God, come let us clap our hands for joy while glorifying God who was truly born of her. Most holy Theotoko, save us. The undefiled chamber of the word for all the cause of deification, O oh, Immaculate, rejoice. The prophet's echoing prophecy, rejoice in the adornment of the apostle's word. Most holy Theotoko, save us. From you has dripped the refreshing dew, undoing polytheism's fever, and we therefore say to you, Rejoice the fleece that was wondrously bedewed, a holy virgin which Gideon foresaw. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Behold, we cry out to you, rejoice. Become for us a harbor and anchorage, for we are tossed about upon the sea of adversities and of the many scandals of him who wars with us, both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. The cause and reason for holy joy cause holy grace to shine on our reasoning that we may cry rejoice. O unconsumed bush and shining cloud that overshadows ceaselessly the believers all, Godly-minded three did not adore created things in the Creator's stead, but
but bravely trampling upon the threat of the furnace fire they chanted joyfully. O supremely praised and most exalted Lord and God, of our fathers you are blessed. Most holy Theotoko save us. We sing hymns to you and shout rejoice, O chariot of the intelligible sun. Rejoice, O veritable vine, that cultured the ripened cluster dripping with wine, making glad the hearts and souls of all who faithfully praise and glorify you daily. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Bride of God, rejoice, who carried in your womb the healer of the human race. Rejoice, O mystical rod, that blossomed the flower that will never wilt away. O lady, rejoice, through whom we are fulfilled with joy and inherit life eternal. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Insufficient is the tongue of any orator for hymns extolling you who were exalted above the seraphim having given birth to Christ the King, whom, O Lady, beseech to rescue now from every harm those who bow in faith before you. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, the ends of the earth, extol you and be edify, and they cry out to you. Rejoice the tablet on which, O pure one, for word the given Father's hand inscribed, intercede with him. O Theotokos, to enroll in the book of life your servants, both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. We, your servants, now beseech you, and we bend the knee of our heart to you. O pure one, lend us an ear, and save us, for we are drowning in adversities, and your city redeem, O Theotokos, from the hands of her infidel invaders. Pious children stood within the furnace, the child of the Theotokos went and rescued them. He who was prefigured then, manifestly acting now, is gathering together the entire universe to sing the hymn, O praise and supremely. Exalt the Lord, O all his works, unto the ages. Most holy Theotoko, save us. You welcomed to your womb the Logos. You held in your arms the one who holds all things. With your milk you nourished him, who with a knot gives nourishment. O purest maiden unto the entire universe, to whom we sing, O oh, praise and supremely, exalt the Lord, O oh, all his works, unto the ages. Most holy Theotoko, save us. The glorious mystery of your childbirth did Moses perceive within the burning bush. Children once in Babylon vividly prefigured this. When standing in the midst of fire, remaining unconsumed, O undefiled and all holy virgin, and therefore we extol you in hymns throughout the ages. Most holy Theotoko, save us. We who were left naked through beguilement have worn through your pregnancy the garment of incorruptibility, and we who were sitting in the darkness of our sins and errors now has seen the light, O dwelling place of light, holy 
damsel, and therefore we extol you in hymns throughout the ages. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. The dead have been given life through your power, for pregnant were you with life personified. They who once were speechless now speak with newfound eloquence. Diseases are exterminated, lepers purified. The legions of aerial spirits, O virgin, are defeated, for you are man's salvation, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. The birth giver of the world's salvation, through you we are raised from earth unto the heights. Ever blessed maid, rejoice, portrait and protective veil. O pure one, the defense and the fortification of all who sing the hymn, O praise and supremely exalt the Lord, O all his works unto the ages. Mortals, one and all, with festival lamps in hand, in spirit leap for joy. And you incorporeal, angelic powers in heaven celebrate the sonoring, the sacred feast of the Mother of God, and salute her. Oh, rejoice, all blessed one, ever virgin and pure who gave birth to God. Most holy Theotoko, save us, so that we may cry, Rejoice unto you through whom we faithful have become, bearers of eternal joy. O maiden, rescue us from the coming trials, barbarian invasions, and from every other scourge which are bound to Follow on the multitude of transgressions committed by sinful men. Lord bless this, your servant, Most holy Theotoko, save us. The ages of ages. Amen. Christ Since you have appeared, bless these, your servants, our your light and our surety, we the therefore ages shout ages. to Amen. you. O unsetting star, rejoice, from which the great sun emerged unto the world. Rejoice, O pure one, for you opened Eden, closed of old. O rejoice, the fiery pillar ushering humankind out of bondage to life on high. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Come and let us stand reverently in the temple of our God and say, Mistress of the world, rejoice. Rejoice, O Mary, the Lady of us all. Rejoice, for among women you alone are blameless and fair. Holy vessel, which accepted the divine, inexhaustible ointment poured over you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Pure and guileless dove, who brought forth the Lord of mercy as an olive branch. Ever virgin, all rejoice, the boast of every devout monastic saint. Rejoice, the crown of laurel of the martyr. Let's rejoice, the divine adornment of the righteous all, and for us the believer's deliverance, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Spare us, O our God, this your own inheritance by overlooking now all of our iniquities. O Christ, accepting for this the fervent prayers of her who without seed conceived on earth and carried you, who in your great mercy and your love for man 
will to take on the form that was not your own. To you as champion, a hunt to Archangel was sent from heaven to say, Rejoice to the failed talk, O Lord. Envisioning you incarnate, O Lord, he stood before her, wrapped in amazement, and with his celestial voice cried out to her, Rejoice. You through whom joy will shine forth. Rejoice, you through whom the curse will vanish. Rejoice, for you are the recalling of the fallen Adam. Rejoice, for you are the redemption of Eve's tears. Rejoice. O oh, height beyond human logic, rejoice, O oh, depth beyond even the sight of the angels, rejoice, you who are the throne of the King, rejoice, for you gave birth to him of who upholds the universe, rejoice, O star revealing the sun, rejoice, womb of divine incarnation, rejoice, you through whom the creation is remade, rejoice, you through whom the creator becomes a newborn child, yet an infant, a She was a virgin, the holy maiden boldly said to Gabriel, Your strange words seem almost unbelievable to my soul. For how do you speak of childbirth without seed as you cry, Alleluia? to know that which is beyond knowledge, the virgin said to the ministering angel, 
How may a son be born from a virginal womb? Tell me. To her he answered a fear, crying out, Rejoice, O seer of the ineffable will of God. Rejoice, faith in the miracle gardens are by silence. Rejoice, you who are the beginning of Christ's miracles. Rejoice, you who are the fulfillment of his commandments. Rejoice, heavenly ladder by which God descended. Rejoice, bridge leading us from earth to he heaven. Rejoice, O wonder most marveled at by angels. Rejoice, O wound bitterly mourned by demons. Rejoice, you who ineffably gave birth to the light. Rejoice, you who revealed the mystery to none. Rejoice, O wisdom surpassing the knowledge of those who claim to be wise. Rejoice, you who enlighten the minds of believers. Hail, O The power of the Most High overshadowed the Virgin, that she might conceive, and he made her fruitful womb a fertile meadow for all those who desire to reap the harvest of salvation by singing Alleluia. to Elizabeth, whose unborn son, recognizing Mary's greeting, rejoiced and with stirrings as though with praises, cried out to the veiled talkers, rejoice, branch of the true vine that never withers, rejoice, you who are the orchard of the purest fruit, rejoice, you who tend to the lover of all mankind. Rejoice, you who gave birth to the planter of our life. Rejoice, field yielding a rich harvest of compassion. Rejoice, Table laden with forgiveness in abundance. Rejoice, you through whom the fields of Eden flower again. Rejoice, for you prepare a haven for our souls. Rejoice, O oh incense acceptable for intercession. Rejoice, you who are the whole world's expiation. Rejoice, loving kindness of God to mortals. Rejoice, freedom of approach to God for all mortals. Get an infi, an
The righteous Joseph, having doubtful thoughts, seeing you are blameless, they'll talk of us. And suspecting a hidden wedlock was troubled. But when he learned of your conception by the Holy Spirit, he cried out, Alleluia. 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 God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. You have carried the shield of faith of Christ within your heart and trampled underfoot the power of the enemy, O greatly suffering martyr Theodore. You have received a heavenly and eternal crown, for you were undefeated in the battle. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. O you who in all times and places are worshipped and glorified, both in heaven and on earth, Christ our God, long suffering, generous in mercy and rich in compassion loving to the just and merciful to the sinner. You call all to repentance through the promise of blessings to come. Deign, O Lord, at this very hour to receive our supplications and to direct our lives in the way of your commandments. 
sanctify our souls, purify our bodies, set our minds aright, cleanse our thoughts, deliver us from all affliction, wrath, danger, and need. Surround us with your holy angels, that guided and guarded by them, we may reach the unity of the faith and the knowledge of your unutterable glory. For you are blessed unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O you, higher in honor than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim, you gave birth to God the Word in virginity. You are truly the mother of God. You do we exalt. Give the blessing, Father, in the name of the Lord. May God be merciful unto us and bless us. May he cause the light of his countenance to shine upon us and have mercy on us. Amen. O Lady, Bright of God, virginal, pure, blameless, without stain or disgrace, who through your giving birth to the Word of God brought together our fallen state and the things of heaven, you are the only hope of the hopeless, the helper of the oppressed, a ready protection of those who flee to you, and refuge for all Christians. Do not despise me, O wretched sinner, having defiled myself with unclean thoughts, words, and deeds, and in my slothfulness becoming a slave to the passions of life, as you are the mother of God, who is the lover of mankind. Have mercy and compassion on me, a sinner and a prodigal. Accept this prayer from my impure lips, and with your intimacy as a mother, beg your Son, my Lord and my God, to open to me the depths of his loving kindness. Forgive my countless sins, convert me to true repentance, and enable me to do his commandments. Always be near me, for you are merciful, compassionate, and loving. In this present life be with me as an intercessor, as a powerful help to turn away the assaults of my enemies and to guide me to salvation. At the hour of my death be with me to embrace my poor soul and keep away the dreadful sight of the evil demons. On the fearful day of judgment Deliver me from eternal punishment and make me an heir of your Son's glory through the grace and love for mankind of your Son, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. To him and to his eternal Father and to his all-holy good and life-giving Spirit, we offer glory, honor, and adoration, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Now that we are about to lie down to sleep, grant us, O Master, rest for our souls and bodies. Preserve us against the dark slumber of sin and against any impure pleasure of the night. Quiet the assaults of our passions, Arrest the darts that the evil one insidiously throws at us. Still the turbulence of our flesh and calm all earthly and worldly desires within us. Grant us, O Lord, a watchful mind, innocent thoughts, a sober heart, and a gentle sleep free from evil dreams. Raise us at the hour of prayer, strong in the practice of your commandments and ever mindful of your desires. Give us the grace to sing of your glory throughout the night, to praise, bless, and glorify your all-honorable and magnificent name. 
Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages, amen. O you most glorious, ever virgin and blessed Mother of God, commend our prayers to your Son, our God, and entreat him to save our souls through your intercession. The Father is my hope, the Son my refuge, the Holy Spirit my protection. O all holy trinity, glory to you. In you do I place all my hope. O Mother of God, keep me under your protection. Let us pray to the Lord our God that he will deem us worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Wisdom arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be with you all. And with your spirit. The Holy Gospel is according to St. John. Let us listen attentively. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. The Lord said to his disciples, I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine dresser. Every branch of mine that bears no fruit he takes away, and every branch that does bear fruit he prunes that it may bear more fruit. You are already made clean by the word which I have spoken to you. Abide in me and I in you. As the branch cannot bear fruit by itself unless it abides in the vine, neither can you unless you abide in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. He who abides in me and I in him, he it is that bears much fruit, for apart from me you can do nothing. If a man does not abide in me, he is cast forth as a branch and withers, and the branches are gathered, thrown into the fire and burn. If you abide in me, and my words abide in you. Ask whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. to the Lord. To you, O Lord. O most merciful Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, through the intercessions of our all-pure Lady, the Mother of God and ever-Virgin Mary, by the power of your precious and life-giving cross, the protection of all the angelic powers of heaven, the prayers of the honorable, glorious prophet and forerunner, John the Baptist, of the holy, glorious and trumpet, and praiseworthy apostles, of the holy, glorious, and triumphant martyrs, of our righteous and God-bearing fathers, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, your Kim and Anna, and of all your saints. Make our supplications acceptable unto you. Amen. Grant the remission of our sins. Protect us beneath the shelter of your wing. Amen. Drive away all our enemies and fall. Amen. Preserve our lives in peace. Amen. O Lord, have mercy on us and upon your world, and save our souls, for you are merciful and you love mankind. 
bless me and forgive me, holy brethren, for I am a sinner. May, May God, God forgive, forgive you, you, holy, holy Father. Father. Let us pray for peace in the world. Lord, have mercy. For our president and those in civil authority, that they may be strengthened in every good deed. Lord, have mercy. For our Archbishop Gerasimus and all our brothers in Christ. Lord, have mercy. For those who are away from us, our parents, our brethren. Lord, have mercy. For those who have mercy on us and those who serve us. Lord, have mercy. For those who hate us and for those who love us. Lord, have mercy. For those who have asked us, unworthy as we are to pray for them. Lord, have mercy. For the release of all captives. Lord, have mercy. For travelers by land, sea, and air. Lord, have mercy. For those afflicted with sickness. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray also for an abundance of the fruits of the earth. Lord, have mercy. For all our parents and brethren departed from this life. For those who rest in this place and in every other place. Eternal be their memory. Let us pray also for ourselves. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Thank you all for being here tonight. God bless you. Kalisad Akosti, a beautiful and joyful Lent. So you are welcome to come up and just